Hey there, welcome to this Farming Simulator 22 tutorial on fences. We'll talk about how to place fences and some of their limitations. And I have a handy tip for you, so stay tuned. Alright guys, you're going to go to your con construction tab, decorations, and then fences. We're here, uh, Giants has given a whole lot of fences to choose from if you want to place them down to decorate your farms. So that is really cool. So we're here on the Hoot Aileron map. And we're in an area here, as you can see, has a little bit of a grade, some hills. So I wanted to talk about uh, your fencing options and the limitations, as well as how to remove the fences. And I have a, a tip on placing gates. So for, what we're going to do is start off here, and let's just place some fence. We'll start down here by the field. And then as you can see, the fence really conforms to the hills. Now that is a little bit steep there. It's not going up there. So let's just, we'll place it there. We'll come along. And we're having having some issues there. Let's stop it there. Yeah, so it's not going up the hill. That hill is just a little bit too steep. But as we can see here, it does really well conforming to the land. How about that? How easy is that? It looks really good. So the question would be is how do you get rid of fencing? That's really easy. You're going to click the demolish button right here and just click the panels that you want to get rid of. Super easy. Let's put in a gate. We're going to put in a gate that we can drive through and you notice that the it will snap to uh, a nearby post. So for instance, if we want to snap it to that post, you could. Now we're not going to do that, but we are going to put it here on this post and there's a gate. Now, if you notice, it's telling you which way the gates will swing. And so swinging in will not work. So in this case, you would want to place it on from that side. So we'll, we'll put the gate over here. And we put it in. And then if you want to add more fence to finish that, just like that. How about that? Now a tip that I would recommend is when you start placing your fence, is start with a gate. Now this one actually worked out. That was, uh, we got lucky on that one. It worked out pretty good. But let's try a different one here. But what I want to do is start with the gate. And then we'll place our fence. And the reason for that is because the fence is adjustable. You can adjust the fence distance. But once you place the fence down, the gate is a fixed distance. So if you start with the gate, then your fence will match up and look really well. Isn't that great? That is a really cool feature that Giants has implemented into the game. Now, one thing I do want to mention is there are some, there are some fences such as this stone pillared fence. Now, it does conform when you're dragging it out, but it it says train too steep. The, the ones with the bricks do not like the slope because if we go over here to a different style of fence such as uh, the wire one right here you can see there it it will conform to the the curvature of the land much better so some of the fences work better than others even like this wooden one here would work on it but then you start getting into some of these panel fences and they don't like the steep terrain like this metal fence here does not like to bend which is the case for real life. But a lot of options, most of the fences will work pretty good, uh, but some of them do not like the, the steep curves as much. And also the ones with the, uh, the concrete pillars, they are real finicky on the, on the slope of the ground. So just be mindful of that. 
See, it, it just won't even connect there. Surprised it let me put it down. So something to consider. You'll have to play around with it. Find what will work for you. But all in all, it is a very good system. Very pleased with the way Giants implemented it. Gives us a lot more flexibility on placing fences. And it's so much easier. I'll tell you, that was the biggest thing. Having to put down the panels in Farm Sim 19. Well, in Farm Sim 22, it is much, much simpler. So I hope you found this useful. If you did, please give the video a like. If you're not a subscriber to the channel, click that button today. Go ahead and join the channel. I'd appreciate that. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you soon.